correct my memory. Maybe, I, maybe I'm getting a little older. Uh, when they played the Cowboys, didn't he say he hated the Cowboys growing up because his father was a giant? That was Jamal, right? Hated the Cowboys. I don't remember that, so I don't want to jump on that. I, I'd rather poke at the fact that um, he's, he's getting on the Jets for shopping him when all the Jets did was take a phone call. But when he defended himself about saying he wanted to be a Cowboy, it's because he took the phone call from Ryan Clark. You, you see what I'm saying? Mm -mm. So the Jets were wrong for taking phone calls to trade him. That right. meant they were shopping him. But don't kill him for saying he wanted to be a Cowboy. He only said that because he took the call from Ryan Clark. I see what you did there. Um, he, he's really, I, he's going to really regret what he's doing. He, no, he's not. He's not going to no, regret it at all because he's going to end up where he wants. Maybe not in the immediate, but at some point down the road, it may not be for 10 years, he's going to look back at this time and be like, wow, I was a child. Like, he's just like, a. right now he's just acting like a child whose pride got hurt. He's not well, thinking through this. I'm wondering, is Le'Veon Bell being the good teammate because he regrets what he did in Pittsburgh? Like, I just wonder, like, when it's all said and done, you look back and go, yeah, you're right. Uh, I'm, a, I'm a more mature now. I look, and boy, did I waste time there by being that way. But these guys live in the moment. You know, it's clear now. Nobody wants to be on a losing team. If you're great and, you wanna, and you're on a losing team, there's been enough evidence that you can get out. You either gut it out and try to make it work, or you try to uh, plan an exit strategy. Now, he's denying that, but everything he's doing right now is trying to rub as many people the wrong way, so eventually they'll have no choice but to let him go. Went on to talk about how he's uncertain of his future as a Jet. You know, like I said, man, I don't know the future. I really don't. Um, you know, I'm, I'm excited to be here right now as we speak. Um, I'm excited to put on, put on a uniform. I'm excited to be a part of this organization. Um, but, you know... For the future, I don't know. I really don't. Um, I thought I did, but I don't know right now. Now, he comes out and says he does not regret his tweet from yesterday. Man, some people say everything. I mean, people have a, a, a negative comment about everything. You know, it is what it is. Um, I felt it needed to be, t to be said. Um, and, you know, I don't, I don't regret it. I, I don't. Um, you know, like I said, man, I'm, I'm going to continue to be a professional. Um, a lot of people probably disagree, um, but a lot of people disagree with a lot of people's uh, decisions on what they do in life, period. Um, so I'm not, I'm not focused on that. Um, you know, I'm, I'm, I'm focused on this team. I'm focused on what we can do to, to win this next game. That's our focus. Yeah, then shut up. If you're focused on them winning the next game, then shut up and don't create a distraction. Finally, he was asked if he's spoken with the general manager, Joe Douglas, yet. I have not. I haven't. I haven't. Um, I'm not ready to talk. That's just where I'm at with it. Um, just not ready to talk. You know, when you go through something, sometimes it's best to just kind of let it cool down. And then when you're ready to talk and have a have a conversation, we definitely can. And, and I, I believe that, you know, we definitely will. But I'm not ready to talk about it. So you don't want to talk to somebody because you're going to give it time. You don't you don't want to react in real time. But you'll send out a tweet. Isn't that the rule that we teach all young people with Twitter? Think about it. Don't hit send. Think about it. So he'll, he'll say to the world that he thinks that, you know, the business is BS. But he won't talk to his boss, essentially. What, uh, sports is, sports is, is getting away from me. It really is. It really is.